Hello there, in this video I'm going to show you how to fix a little problem when we scale the armature. So we can scale it up, we can scale it down, it normally causes a little bit of problems. Here I have an animation that is pretty simple, so that's basically what it does. Alright, but then we have a problem. Let's say that I need to scale this armature, so I'm going to scale it up by 5 and then I'm going to apply the scale when I do that you can already see that something here changed and then uh, let's check yeah it doesn't seem to be doing the same thing so that's basically because we upscaled the armature but we didn't upscale the, the animation curves and that's where the problem comes one thing that we can actually see here is that the rotation for example for the arms is not bad it's working just fine the only thing that gets some problems is the the location ones so the things that we moved around like the body and the feet so to fix it it's pretty simple the thing we are going to do is we are going here to the action editor. We are going to press Control Tab. So this way we go to the curves editor. Or we can change it from here. And then we are going to search for location. Like so. Okay. Now that we have it. Let's make sure that everything here is not hidden. So I'm going to press Alt H. Just so it's all visible and then we are going to select everything so pressing a to select everything and then we are going to get the cursor in y to zero this is very important we get the cursor in y to zero and now we are going to press point period full stop whatever and we are going to choose 2d cursor you can also choose it from here so 2d cursor nice now that we have it, we know that we scaled the armature by a factor of 5. So we are going to scale this here by the same amount. So it's going to be S, Y to constrain it on the Y axis, and then 5. And that's basically it. Now we accept and run the animation. And as we can see, it works just fine. Yeah, so that's basically it for this video. Hope it helped you and see you in the next one.